Cardano ADA price prediction June 2020. Welcome back guys, it's Crypto Rocco from Rockstar Trading Channel. In today's video guys, I'll be giving you guys an update on Cardano Shelly testnet launch. I'll give you guys my thoughts on Cardano's news that's coming out. And guys, I'll be sharing with you my price prediction of where I'm looking to buy and sell Cardano. So guys, Cardano had a big move up with the Shelly testnet launch news. If you have been subscribed to my channel, I highly recommend if you haven't subscribed to my channel, subscribe to my channel, smash that like button and turn on the notification button. I made a video on Shelly testnet breakout and it has been a really good breakout. I think I posted it in our group when we got in, uh, got in around when it was breaking out and I posted a YouTube video here so you still could have made some money on it. So I'll be sharing with you what my thoughts are on it now, but let's have a quick look at the news first. So Cardano guys, there are now over 200 stake pools on the Cardano Shelly testnet. So that is a positive news. So according to the company's weekly product update this week is set to see the implementation of Shelly functionality with the Daedalus wallet as well as minor upgrades to KPIs and overall user experience of the network. It seems to be nothing uh, but good news is coming out of IOHK, the company behind Cardano. Uh, this is the, the update that came out but to see this number already is a testament to the competency and comp commitment of Cardano community and the experience we all gained through the build out of the ITN in the early part of this year. Uh, one news the update came from Charles Hodgkinson, the main man behind Cardano. In August hundreds of operators like these will be running Cardano. In a few years thousands will be also with Hydra channel oracles and dozens of other decentralized services. That that's true decentralization, resili resilience and progress. Some good news coming out of Cardano's mainnet Shelly testnet launch. Uh, another news I want to read up, I probably don't agree with it, but just sharing with you some news. Hodgkinson's Cardano says that Cardano's prism will compete with Microsoft with news announcement. I probably think that's probably too far ahead, but that is what he's coming up with. But the reality is that all the things we are working on for the last five years are coming together all at once. Now we're in a situation where we can ship things in matter of weeks that normally would take us months with the old code and processes. The other thing is we are starting to get compared Competitive advantage from Haskell. What people don't understand about Haskell and the fu functionality programming is yes, it's very hard, there's a big barrier to entry, but you have to write a lot less code. So, cases five to ten times less code than C, C, and Java. So, if people you know, coders can probably vouch for me. If people, you know, you can code in something a lot easier, then obviously it would help with Cardano Aiders as a as a platform-based cryptocurrency blockchain, I think they'd really help get implementation and adoption. Like our identity product Prism, we're going to do major demo at the summit in July. Then we should give you guys a beautiful roadmap of how we want to get out into the market and compete with Microsoft and other offerings probably before the end of the year. Again, these are huge, huge claims. I don't just buy because of that. You guys know me. Again, I can show you exactly how I traded probably be too far back if you check on the you watch this youtube video you'll see exactly where i bought it and how what my strategy was i showed you how i bought it at the moment cardano is not breaking out but yesterday's video I, I i do this post yesterday's video we looked at qkc again you can watch the yesterday's video it's not an after the fact you can check the date as well qkc had a big breakout uh, today as you can see this is another coin that we're looking at. So uh, it, I mean, you can be interested in Cardano and just hodl or trade this coin, but there's loads of other opportunities. Maybe hodl half and learn to trade with the other half. I'll talk about it at the end of the video. So talking, coming back to Cardano, these are some huge claims for Cardano. If they are true, I've not seen many cryptocurrencies that have showed that that type of adopt, adoption. We've seen it a bit with Chainlink, where it had hundreds of thousands, hundreds and hundreds of percents of big moves up. If Cardano can get something like that out there and see adoption, Cardano price will be a lot higher. I'll share with you the strategy I look to get back into Cardano. I just don't trust this cryptocurrency news as much because we have seen pump and dumps in theta uh, and we've seen it with hundreds of coins I'm, i don't have to repeat some of the pumps we have seen 
so uh, Cardano Foundation this is another news that, that I quite like the date for the virtual summit for Shelley was sec uh, was announced for July 2nd and 3rd one thing I like about Cardano is we've seen in Theta they had a main net launch it went up and then dumped afterwards whereas Cardano you see an ongoing news coming out so potentially this won't be a pump and dump and C uh, Cardano hasn't gone up that much it's gone up about 50% whereas Theta had gone up a lot more so Cardano may have more room to run from a technical point of view this is a huge resistance when I took that trade I recommend you watch again watch and learn for yourself watch the videos for Cardano that I'd, I've done almost one a week you can see what my thoughts process changed and you can see the plans worked out quite well I'm not saying all my plans work but this one worked really well so that's my, one of my th reasons why thinking Cardano might not just be a pump and dump. So I think the virtual summit will probably have some positive news for Cardano and we'll see big pushes and moves up. We've seen in other cryptocurrencies when big announcements came in this summit and the price moved up. And also there's some new appointments as well in Cardano. I think one of them is a British person. Uh, they're looking to expand Cardano's reach and how they want to grow. So the network is located in Dublin, Ireland, sorry, not not. England and not Britain it's in Ireland and you can see there's some other people in in Toronto as well so they're continuing to expand so these are all positives for Cardano some good news coming out which we like to see so what do I want to see with price let's come back to what I do best for price guys um, my thinking is it needs to stay above this daily moving average previously when we have seen Cardano pump this was a pump that we traded beautifully in Cardano if you had been subscribed to my channel you would have known uh, it bounced from the daily moving average then it closed below it once it closes below it I don't get too excited I'm actually not in uh, Cardano trading at the moment I want to buy on breaks above 618 or ideally where I've got my alert set uh, my previous alert was here when we broke out that's my alert if we can't stay above the daily if we stay above the daily and it gives me a setup my setup is a moving average pullback setup if I get something like this here or ideally above 950 I would definitely get back into Cardano if we close below this daily moving average a simple indicator let's say around 200 800 I think we might be able to buy Cardano at a cheaper price around the 7 to 600 level again I won't just blindly buy it you can see it's already reacted from it I look for a you know trend change on the shorter time frame something like this to get back in so that's my thoughts on Cardano from a trading strategy uh, I'll keep you guys updated in the group how I'm trading Cardano Cardano is a popular coin so I'm always updating on how we are trading Cardano. If Cardano does break out and I see the alert I'm at my desk I will let you guys know and I'll also make a YouTube video afterwards to keep my YouTube fans updated as well. So that's my thoughts on Cardano. Uh, hopefully you guys enjoy it. To end the video what is your thoughts on Cardano? Do you think Cardano will see big moves up? Do you think Cardano is a solid project if you're thinking about investment it's long it takes months years and years for investments to come through and I'm not advising on investment I'm sharing with you my thoughts on trading it and how I'm looking to trade it with news coming out and if I see my technical analysis price setups I think Cardano can have a big move up as long as it stays above 700 600 zone and the probably the weekly uh, moving average I would tend to be on the bullish side of things if we break below like we have done here guys I won't be as bullish on Cardano. Let's see what Cardano does. Um, I don't want it to be like another pump and dump like many other coins with news coming out. It could potentially move up. So comment below your thoughts on Cardano. Uh, make sure you smash that like button, subscribe to my channel and comment below your predictions for Cardano. I'm getting close to 10k subscribers so thank you all for supporting me. If you want to take your trading to the next level you can check out our group there's a unit section available for new people to get started. You can check us out for a month and there's an offer on the yearly as well. It's a lot less than 199 if you're interested. You can check it out. I'll leave the links below. If not, guys, I'll continue to provide content on YouTube. So smash that like button, subscribe to my channel and I'll see you guys soon with another great video. Go Cardano!